My name is Jeff Silverman. I'm the chairperson of the Textile Development and Marketing Department um, at FIT in New York City. Students coming into the program uh, can expect to learn how to develop textiles, um, uh, where textiles are made, how to resource textiles, how to uh, deal with quality assurance problems. Our students will learn about textile fibers, they will learn about yarns, they'll learn about fabric forming methods. Um, you can have woven textiles, you can have knitted textiles, you can have non-woven textiles. They're, they all have different properties, they're all for different uses. They can be made out of natural fibers like cotton, like wool, or synthetic fibers um, like polyester or nylon. By and large, the student that does very well in our major is the student who's very curious, the student who likes to tinker with things, work with their hands, understand things, take things apart, put them back together, build fabric, understand the different properties, the different properties you can build into as well as the different properties you can expect out of the fabric if it has a particular content. We are unique in that we're right in the middle of the marketplace. Um, our students will either intern or work part-time while they're going to school at different textile companies. They'll go to work for the major fashion brands. There's a lot of reasons why being in New York is so important. Because it is New York City, uh, you have access to some of the best faculty in the world. They call this color romance. Does that look like romance to you? Mm -hmm. I don't know. In order to teach in our department, um, you have to have a minimum of 10 years of industry experience. So everybody in the department has that kind of experience. And if you think about how a textile is made, and we're not just talking about the fiber or the yarn and the manufacturing, we're also talking about the coloring and the finishing and all the different treatments that, that it really needs. Everybody has their own specialty. Everybody has their own area of expertise. And everybody can contribute something. Our students are basically the people that are on the staff um, um, of various companies who can be involved in any form of textiles. Um, and they're the people that go and solve problems. Our students go all over the world because every time, every time the product is produced in a different country, our students have to go there. We have a department project that we've been working on. This is the fifth year that we've done it where the students develop a line of genes from concept all the way through finished product. Um, and last year what we did was we thought that, well, we should add one more leg on to it every year. And last year what we did was um, we started out at a cotton farm. So they got to see the plants um, being, the plants growing, the plants being ginned uh, and harvested. Uh, then they saw the spinning mill um, and they, they took it all the way through. Um, then they worked with a New York fabric uh, um, to develop the, the rinses and the washes that go onto the jeans. And then they worked with a pattern maker to help with the fit. And then they worked with Google, who's on our advisory board, to help them develop their internet strategy. And um, 14 other advisors that helped them along the way to develop um, a line of jeans. Textile development and marketing is creating beautiful fabrics, wonderful wonderful textiles that are used all over the world by all different sorts of people for all different sorts of uses.